Greetings all staff and faculty and students of Valencia College. I'm Sandy Sugar, your president, and I'm coming to you today to talk about the way forward from the tragic events that we've experienced in our community this past week. Of the 49 victims, seven were Valencia students. We need to feel that loss. We need to come around their family and friends and support them. And we need to take the time to do that before we rush to the other things that will be important for us to do. Those things will become apparent to you as you live with this hard reality. But you're not alone, and we'll do this together. So first, let me encourage you to take the time to reflect. Be silent. Be still. Don't fill every moment with the media flurry. Take the time to process what's happened. Join with the people you love and embrace them. Come to school here at Valencia ready to hug and support others. And in due course, we need to have all the conversations that are important for processing this. And there's several I want to mention today. One is to honor those that were lost. The second is to make sure that we're aware that there are many kinds of victims, not just those who were killed in the onslaught of bullets, but those who are close to them, those who feel an affinity to them. You may be Hispanic and feel that affinity. You may be in the LGBT community and feel that affinity. You may just feel vulnerable right now. We're all in this together. And there's no more inclusive place than Valencia College, nor more diverse. So you have plenty of friends here. Let's celebrate that and join together. Third is to make sure we don't exclude those who may feel at risk for other reasons. We have many wonderful staff and students of Muslim faith, and they feel frightened and distressed and angry over what's happened. Be sure to embrace them too. They didn't cause this. This was the act of a madman, a crazy person, not, not a faith. So be sure to get room for them too to process their grief. We can do this together. One, one Valencia, one student body, one faculty and staff, one community. We can do this. And we'll be forever changed by this. We'll never be the same. Let's make sure the change we experience is one we want to, that is to become enlarged and not diminished, to become um, gracious and not judgmental, to let love rule and not hate. I know you can do that.